always been very, very kind to me, and I don't even know why. She started the show with a powerful performance, and she ended it by sweeping the big awards. Adele reigns as the queen of the 2017 Grammy Awards. And tonight, we're getting a behind-the-scenes look at the show. We have team coverage for you of music's biggest night, beginning with CBS2 Entertainment reporter Suzanne Marquez. She's live at Staples Center with what you didn't see on the show. Suzanne. And Pat and Rick, we know who are the big winners of the night. Bruno Mars, that electrifying performance. Of course, Beyonce for all the reasons. And of course, Adele, we got her backstage. But I can't possibly accept this award. And I'm very humbled and I'm very grateful. Adele won five Grammys and is the first person to win record, album, and song of the year twice. And even brought Beyonce to tears, dedicating her album of the year trophy to Queen Bay. I fell in love immediately with her. Um, and that was when I was 11, and I'm 28 now. And the way that I felt when I first heard No, No, No was exactly the same as how I felt when I heard Lemonade. <laughs> The original members of Morris Day and the Time brought the audience to their feet in their tribute to Prince. With Bruno Mars dressed up and tearing it up as the purple one himself. He ripped it up. So, you know, I think it was perfect. I, I don't think there's another artist who could have pulled it off as perfectly with us as, as Bruno did. What do you say, Jimmy Jam? I said, but we still kicked his <laughs> <laughs> Beyonce won two Grammys and pregnant with twins gave a stunning performance that was an ode to motherhood and family. I know it's live TV, I'm sorry, I need to start again. Adele began a tribute to the late George Michael out of key and started over. Last year, her microphone cut out during her performance. Host James Corden intentionally had a slip up, taking a tumble down the Grammy stairs and losing a shoe. This is the Grammys, people. <laughs> James Corden did an incredible job his first time hosting. We also caught up with his mom on the red carpet. You don't want to miss that. Pat and Rick, I'll send it back to you for now.